Hey everyone, welcome back. And in this video, let's take how a computer software can now make videos just from images or just from prompt. Facebook or Beta has released a make a video website which claims that it can make videos from just a text input. Now, if you have been following a bit into this AI world, you know there have been so many advances. There is Stable Diffusion, which is an open source implementation of what DALI 2 does, for example. There is Codex, there is GPT-3, and now there is Make a Video, which is an AI based tool which can create seemingly, I won't say like <laughs> real looking, but it, it, it can create pretty fun videos just with the text prompt. So you can see if you write cat watching a TV with a remote in hand, it could spit out a video like this. So there are a bunch of examples, robot dancing in Times Square, where it shows what the AI could record and what the AI could create. Now the interesting thing with this, just like it is with stable diffusion or other AI tools for image generation, is that you can actually tweak the output. Now, just giving a prompt, it's not very useful a lot of times because the prompt does not give you accurate results. So in order to tweak it, you can also provide it some static images or provide it some starter boilerplate things to do, right? For example, in this case, if you are providing it a single image, it can kind of create a variation depending on that this image is of a sea, there is a boat. So it just extrapolates the data which is required for the video. If you give it a pair of images, it might be able to get more information from what the context is. Similarly, you can also provide it some sort of input video and create a variation of it. This is amazing if you want to get some sort of variations, but you don't want, you know, a lot of time to be spent on it. You just want some AI or some software to just create a bunch of variations. Works awesome on DALI 2 and Stable Diffusion as well. If you provide it with a, a source image, it can really output great quality images. So as of now, this is not a publicly available tool which you can play with. You can sign up for this access, which takes you to a very small Google form. You can just fill this up and get started with it but yeah this seems interesting they have released the research paper so if you are someone who's an ai guy who understands how this research paper is laid down maybe you can read it go through it but it will be only pretty much useful when meta for example releases some sort of information on how to use this tool with a prompt with an input image with an input video or anything but the important thing here is that ai is becoming strong right so a lot of things have been happening in the ai world open AI recently released Whisper, which is a speech to text based conversion tool, which works really well across a lot of languages. That is also super interesting to see because this will disrupt the industry in a way. There are SaaS platforms which offered speech to text, for example, back in the day. And I mean, like open sourcing something like this completely destroys those businesses, but would enable more businesses to be created. So that is one thing. Codex, for example, I've done multiple videos on what GitHub Copilot is and Codex is and should you use it, should you not use it. So that is also a question, should you use it or not? But at the end of the day, it's an interesting technology. And similarly, this makeavideo.studio now comes out and pitches that, hey, you can create full blown videos just from text and just from video prompts. So I'm not surprised. I will not be surprised if we just see, you know, something which is very creative, very polished, very finished, which will take a lot of effort also, because like I mentioned, fine tweaking things from AI does take effort. It will take a lot of effort, but I won't be surprised if I see something thing which is a very creative work out there in the next few months or even years so yeah that's pretty much it for this video hoping that you get to learn something more something new interesting in every single one of them what do you think about this ai making a video let me know in the comments below that is all for this one i'm gonna see you in the next video really soon if you're still watching this video make sure you comment down in the comment section i watched this video till the end also if you're not part of code dumps discord community you are missing out out a lot on events which we organize on a weekly basis to code you already know the drill make sure you like the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and thank you so much for watching